I have absolutely nothing with me, not even clothes. And my goal is to travel around the world for free. But first, I need to find a t-shirt. Buy a house. You want me to give you a t-shirt? Yes. Yes, yes. I will wear this in all my journey. Oh my God. After this, while I was walking on the famous Hollywood street, someone gave me his jacket. Socks as well. Oh, shit. Oh my God. <laughs> Look who it is! Do you want some shoes? No, I want your shoes. Oh, you want my shoes? Can I get your shoes? Yes, have them, have and, them, have and, them. And can I get this as well? My pants? Oh, yeah. you got my pants? You are going to wear them. I want to buy you pants. Okay. Come here, we'll buy some pants. <laughs> This is the pants that she bought. He's gonna see her. I love you. Bye bye. So now we're going to Santa Monica Pier to collect money. Okay, here we are. I'm collecting money to travel to Japan. Do you have any change with you guys? So what? Maybe you better twerk or something. Okay. Oh my goodness. Oh my god. Oh. 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 Did I entertain you enough? <laughs> That's good. <laughs> Five dollars, oh my god. I started asking for money to everyone at the pier. And even though I had some rejections, a lot of people were generous and helped me. We made around $40 in one hour. So if I stay here for six hours, I'm going to make the money for the ticket. Let's go back to work. I spent all day asking for money. Oh and I'm not gonna lie, it was very hard. But I made $250 in eight hours of work. This feels illegal. Now, next destination, airport. To go there, I had to sneak in the metro, which was easy. But while I was recording myself in the metro, this happened. Put that bitch to me. That's right, white boy. You better turn that shit off. A stranger got mad at me that I was filming and he started threatening me and while we were talking he took an axe from his back and broke the window next to me. Honestly guys now I'm afraid for my life. So I left the train now. This I think was the most dangerous moment of my life. Hello sir. I want to buy a ticket. Okay. I can see passport. Yes. Thank you. I think I've seen you on YouTube. Don't you like, didn't you hug um, Elon Musk? I saw yes. that, man. It's crazy. Yes, Elon Musk is amazing. He's my hero. Take a seat. Where now we look at the price first and we let you know. Okay, thank you. If they say something more than 250, I'm. Hello, sir. The price will be 1,298. Yes, sir. Oh my god, that's a lot of money. Right now, the fly is full. That's why the price is. Hi, well, I only have 250. I guess we're not going to Japan. I asked the information desk and they told me that between Los Angeles and Japan is Hawaii. So it's better for me to fly tonight to Hawaii and get money from there to go to Japan. I didn't have any other choice. With the money I had, I bought a ticket to Hawaii. Aloha. Aloha. <laughs> we're going to Hawaii. Yeah. <laughs> I'm like a kid in the park. Hawaii, we're coming. The girl next to me saw me holding a camera and she started asking questions. And when I told her the truth that I don't have a place to stay, she said this. I have a couple of friends that might be able to host you. Yeah, it's a place to stay. <laughs> Hawaii, here we are. You are in Hawaii now. I know that. <laughs> she not only found a place for me to stay, she took me to that place with her car. Oh. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. Oh my god, what is this? It's a lake. Yes, we're in Hawaii. Perfect. Her place was beautiful. I can't believe I got all this for free. Guess what, guys? We're going to the beach. Yes. I can't believe this is true. Oh my god. Sheesh. <laughs> After I spent some time in the car talking with Pauline, I think she's the most open-minded girl I ever met in my life. Here we are, we came in the beach. I love traveling so much. Woohoo! The best! Woo Woo Today, I will enjoy a bit traveling and tomorrow, we worry about how I'm going to get to Japan. Oh my god, look at these guys. I love it. The sun is going down. This is the second night of the challenge. She cooked Japanese food. Is this a coincidence? I'm going to Japan next. But the struggle was yet to come. I just woke up and look at this. Wow. So yesterday it was relaxing and traveling. And today it's time to see how we're going to get out of here 
to go to Japan. No jokes now. I was talking with my beautiful friends here. <laughs> <laughs> Pauline had a great idea about a surfboard. They have surfboards here. This one. I'm going to rent it to people for $20 an hour this is the greatest right? idea a person yeah. ever had this is my money making vehicle looks good i will try to bring everything back <laughs> please do <laughs> i have a surfboard and i'm going to the beach to make some money <laughs> i can't believe it's winter look at these guys feels like a summer the goal today is to make 210 dollars for the ticket i have a surfboard my goal is to collect money to go to japan okay, okay. do you want to rent my surfboard do i want to <laughs> <laughs> i don't think that would be a good idea for me or your surfboard well, i think we're okay no so you are not going to be my first customer today. i'm so sorry not today, not today. Not today. <laughs> i will leave my shoes here and i'll go around ask for people do you want to rent my surfboard by any chance for one hour uh, no, really. Me either, but you can try to learn. It's all good, thank, thank you. Thank you so much. Failure. I think my approach is wrong. I'm renting this surfboard. Are you interested, beautiful girls? This is the best deal of your life, I promise. Sir, I know you want to rent this. How much? $20 an hour. I've never tried It's okay, you can try now. And you go with me? If you want me to go with you, it's $40. But you can... $40? Yes, if you want a photo as well, $50. Okay. So $50. Yes. Good um, photo. Good photo, I promise. So we're going together. I will show you how to surf, but I never surfed in my life. Are you ready? Yes. You have to do up when wave is coming. Show me. <laughs> Am I a good teacher or no? <laughs> when a wave comes, you have to be very fast with your hands, okay? This is great, guys. Fast, 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 fast! Ah. Did you have fun? Yes. After we came out, other people got jealous and they came to rent my surfboard. So this guy accepted with $30. So far we have 100. Another 110 to go. Love your content, man. It's inspiring. Oh, wow. Oh, Do you yeah. want to be my next customer? Um, I don't really surf, but <laughs> how about... Are, are you hungry? I guess, yeah. <laughs> uh, you know. <laughs> Oh wow. Thank you for the meal so much guys. Have an amazing vacation. I love this life. These experiences, ups and downs. When you have nothing and you get something, it's amazing. So I forgot my shoes in the other side of the beach. So I'm walking back now to find them. Let's see if my shoes are there. Okay. Wow, this is very surprising. People in Hawaii doesn't steal. Oh my God, home sweet home. I'm so tired. Making for my first time in my life. <laughs> Cookies. This is actually the first time in my life that I'm baking something. Mom, I made it. <laughs> oh my God, they are actually good. <laughs> Shower and I'm ready to sleep. Tomorrow we need to collect another a hundred and seven dollars exactly. I came to the beach, but I'm very tired because it was one hour walk with the surfboard. Sucks, but we have to do what we have to do. I did the same thing all day, teaching people how to surf and renting my surfboard. And finally, yes, I found my last customer. Yes. Thank you so much! We have two hundred dollars! I'm going to Japan! <laughs> and this is the last night and she made me food. I know. I'm gonna miss you. The next morning, Polly took me to the airport and she gave me a gift card and told me to read it in the plane. I love you, thank you so much for everything. Oh my god. Until next time. Best host in Hawaii. And the show must go on. My first time to Japan. Oh, very good. Yeah, enjoy. enjoy. <laughs> Thank you. Ready to go. It's a seven hour flight and we're getting closer to Japan. This is what she wrote. I'm amazed by your integrity and drive to accomplish the goals you set for yourself. My only wish is to use your platform to showcase the good in the world and spread kindness 
everywhere you go. I promise you, Pauline, I will try my best. And a cart of surfing. This is day five of this journey. Very tiring so far, but very educational and rewarding as well. Japan! The only goal is to not get arrested. <laughs> now I'm in a place close to Tokyo and I need to find a way to go to Tokyo by stealing the train. They told me that this train goes to Tokyo. I'm going to go in the train now. Oh, the person that checks the ticket is coming. That's why I'm going to lock myself the whole time in the toilet so they don't check the ticket that I don't have. Good old trick. Knocking the door. Checking the GPS and it says that we are here. We are here. <laughs> and this is how you take the train for free. Here I am in Tokyo. This is the most polite people I met in my whole life, man. There is so many people, but it's kind of peaceful. Say cheese! <laughs> I am trying to make money here in Japan. What do you suggest for me to make money? How about doing e-commerce? E-commerce? Yeah. <laughs> you don't think I will be able to make money here in Japan? No. Ah. Not a lot of people speak English here. And I'll have a hard time making money, guys. So there is a big trick when you travel for free. And actually, when you travel generally. Couch surfing. This is not an ad. Stay and listen. Couch surfing is an application that locals host you for free in their house. I found a person through the application and I'm going to meet him now in this place here. Oh my god, it's cold. Thank god that I have a place to stay tonight. Oh my god, nice to meet you. This is my couch surfing host. And you hosted how many people? Probably about 300. Oh my god, this is crazy. And this is it's war. Oh wow. <laughs> Why do you host? People. Why do I host people? To meet interesting people. Otherwise, I'm just working all the time. Everyone has a different story, right? I get to learn something about the country. I get to learn something about them. So everyone has a story why they're doing it, why they can't. This or... guy is not the normal couch surfing guy. Normal couch surfer, they host maybe 20 people, maybe max. But this guy hosted 300 just people. Keep going. After I told him I didn't eat food for 24 hours, he immediately took me out for dinner. Thank you so much. Thank yeah, you so you're much. Welcome. He's paying for my food, guys. Oh, so tomorrow we need to find out how we are going to make money. And as I understood, it's going to be probably the most difficult task of this video. This is the couch that I'm going to sleep on. Good night. The next day, my host had an idea for me to make money. Today, the method that we're going to make money is teaching Japanese people how to speak English. It's about $75 an hour. Now we just need to show this to thousands of people. So I'm here in one of the biggest train stations in Tokyo. I'll just hold my sign like this. Let's see how much time it will take me to get my first client. So it's been an hour that I'm standing here and nobody came to even talk to me. So I think this is the wrong approach. Hello. English lesson? English lesson? No. I don't know how I'm going to live from Japan, honestly. It's too expensive. He said it's too expensive. People here are a bit more close and shy. They are not open to talk with strangers. I'm doing this for five hours now and it's not working. But at least I have a good view of Tokyo. It's very difficult to make money here, guys. The people are not very approachable, not very social. This is the lowest point that I've been in this video. Clearly the sign is not working, so we're going to try a different different approach. We're going to ask people to pay for our entire ticket. Do you no. want to be that person? Not a chance. I wish I could, but I don't have enough money, man. No, we're Americans. We don't give anything out for free. Nothing seems to be working, guys. I'm a disaster. I'm a complete failure. Definitely today was the toughest day of the challenge. The people are polite and they are nice, but it's very difficult to speak with them and connect with them. Japan, a difficult destination. Ah! 
So because I did it easily on United States, India, and Europe, I thought that I, I would do it easily, but I haven't made a single dollar all day. All I can do now is go home, sleep, and hope that the next day will be better. I just woke up, this is day seven. He was seeing me that I was struggling a lot with making money in Japan. And he said that he will help with the ticket, guys. Yeah. Oh my God, there thank you, go. you so much. No worries. I got a bit emotional because I was not expecting this. There is something special happening. Oh my God, guys, it's stoic. <laughs> it's cold, it's freezing. Oh my God, it's so beautiful. Look at all these kids waiting. Hello. Hello. Let's eat some. Free water. After a lot of relaxing hours, it was time for me to leave. It sucks that I'm leaving, but the show must go on. It's raining. I can't go like this. I'm going to the shop here and I will beg them to give me an umbrella. The first person I asked in the shop gave me his umbrella. Thank you, thank uh, you. No, no, <laughs> thank you. Have an amazing day. People are nice here as well. probably never saw anything like that in their whole life. They are NPCs, look at them. I'm going to try to sneak in the business class of the plane. I'm going to wait for everyone to go in and then if it's an empty seat inside the business class, I will go in. Thank you very much, Angel. My Bye. pleasure, have a great Bye. day. So sneaking in operation starts now. I immediately went and sat in the only empty seat in the business class. I'm not gonna lie, this is the craziest thing ever. <laughs> From no money, please. They started offering free drinks and snacks. After enjoying one hour of business class, finally they understood that I was not supposed to be there and they moved me back to the economy class. So I got caught. It almost worked. Dubai, I'm coming. So we just landed in. Abu Dhabi. I will try to sleep in the airport and I will wake up tomorrow. People don't steal bags in an airport. I have experience here. I stayed seven days in an airport and I was leaving my stuff all the time and they were not getting stolen. Go watch that video after. It's not very comfortable, but I don't have another choice. So I just woke up. Today is day 10. I'm going to try now to go to Dubai to see the worst tallest building. It's been 10 days that I'm wearing the same clothes. So I'm going to the toilet then I will be back. Oh, two, one. <laughs> I bet you didn't expect this. The sponsor of this video is Kofandi. Actually, Kofandi makes good quality, affordable clothes for men. I'm so excited to show all this stuff. Sir, what do you think about my clothes? They're very good. You look good. Very good. I look sexy. You do, you do. <laughs> Go now to their website and check their whole clothing line. They have a lot of clothes for gym, for everyday life. I still have this on so I can sell it and make money. <laughs> so this is how I'm going to make money in Dubai. Go now to the top link on the description and use my code to get a discount at cofundy.com. Oh my God. It's exactly 35. Have a great day. Thank you. Too. you too. We're going to have an easy time here in this country. So this this time I'm not going to sneak in the bus luggage room. I have a ticket. Thank you. We're here and I have to make money. But I'm tired of making money. So I can't wait to go back home in my apartment actually. I'm sitting here in the mall in Dubai and I met this guy. What's your name? Sunny. And he's from India and we're chatting about his business now. I have a question for you, okay? Hold this. What do you think about it? It's very nice. Very nice. Oh. Do you want to buy it to help me go to Europe? <laughs> but I don't need Burj Khalifa. It's huge. That's what she said. <laughs> I started asking strangers if they want to buy the clothes and immediately I found a person that was interested. So do you want it? <laughs> and that's really cheap. It will help me a lot. Okay, let's see. <laughs> yes. Okay. 90. Oh, it's 90. Yeah, oh. It's 90. Okay, yeah. good. You are the best. Bye. Try to hug Donald Trump or Joe Biden. <laughs> we made all the money and now my plane leaves in 24 hours. So we can enjoy a bit of Dubai. But there is some problems. We don't have a place to stay and also we don't have friends. I'm going to show you how I make friends. What you don't like about Dubai? I'm here for uh, three days now and I don't have anything to say about what I don't like. I love Dubai. Tell me one thing you love about Dubai. Freedom. 
Freedom. Yeah. My favorite thing about Dubai is that it's very diverse. There is people from Pakistan, from India, from all over the world. In some countries they do exclusions, but Dubai I don't think it does. You ask where I'm staying in Dubai, right? I have no place to stay tonight. I'm going to stay in the beach. Are you serious? This is my job. Are you serious? <laughs> yeah. Oh, amazing. Hopefully it doesn't get very cold in the night. Do you have a place for me to stay or a couch or anything? I'll be honest. <laughs> place where I am, we have six people in a small room. You have the bunker beds and I am living there. Okay. So it will difficult. be difficult. Very okay. Difficult, yeah. Good, good. I feel sorry. No, this. no, no, you don't feel. This is the, it's bad to feel sorry tonight we're going to stay outside it will be fun one night in the trip so I walked straight to the closest beach because in this video they stole my stuff I brought a locker now and I locked my stuff on the bed so now I can sleep without fearing that someone will steal my bag it's time to sleep with this beautiful you. Wow, I'm very lucky to believe in these experiences. I'm not gonna lie. I have a pillow, five star bed. Good night, guys. See you tomorrow. I just woke up in the beach and I see something incredible. Wow, this experience of living is amazing. <laughs> We're so fortunate to be alive. So I left from the beach, so I'm walking back to the airport to go to a place that I always was dreaming about Italy so we're going to make my dream a reality together so I just arrived in the airport and we're going to Italy they are not as excited as I am Same. we are out of the airport now it's very early in the morning how much five euros Five euros. Yeah. As usual, a kind person gave me five dollars. I found five euros. Yeah. <laughs> All the time, the media presents the world this evil, bad place. But my experience through the world, and you guys saw it, is that there is so many kind people around the world and this is the reason for making these videos to showcase the kindness of humanity have a great day sir Bye -bye. it's been two days since i ate food guys and i see this stuff so the person from couchsurfing accepted my request in rome now so i have a place to stay yes so the guy from couchsurfing sent me some weird videos i don't know why he sent me this he seems cool. The secret to happy life in my experience is to have zero expectations. So I have no expectations that I will have fun or something. Whatever comes, comes. So now next destination, I'm going to walk to the Colosseum. Oh my God, this looks amazing. <laughs> I see everyone eating. I'm kind of jealous. So this is some leftovers of pizza, yes, here. And eat it. <laughs> because I'm hungry. Oh my god, I see the Colosseum. All the people were gathering together in this Colosseum and they were watching other people fighting lions and dying. It was kind of very crazy to think about. When I travel, I don't like to travel to these touristic destinations. I like to meet the local people. That's why now I'm going to couch surfing to meet the locals and experience the culture of the place. But it is fascinating that this was built more than 1,000 years ago. So the guy from Couchsurfing told me to go to that cafe now. So I'm going to meet him there. And I will ask him if he has any jobs for me. This is the guy from Couchsurfing. We found a guy that has a good mustache. Oh, <laughs> Italiano! <laughs> this is the best guy in the world. Turns out he's a successful businessman and he took me on a tour around his factory. He was busy with meetings, that's why he introduced me to his employee, Giovanni. Hello, Giovanni! <laughs> <laughs> but more about him later. So, you see, guys, this is what traveling is about. Now I'm in a random place and I'm exploring and learning about a random business. So, they take this and they cut it into those small blocks for him to have a whole factory like this he's probably rich we're going somewhere with him they told me to go with him so <laughs> i'm being forced to drink alcohol i never drink guys only once twice a year it's not productive it's good good it's time for wine very good how is it cheers in italia salute Salute. Bellissimo. Ah. <laughs> uh, yeah.
<laughs> lollipop, lollipop. Best gift ever. I love you. How we say I love you in Italian? Ti amo. Ti amo. Ti voglio bene. <laughs> we became really good friends. That's why he wanted to show me his favorite bar in Italy. You, bellissimo. Grazie. <laughs> After you finish work. Boyfriend. Oh. She has a boyfriend. Say in English, subscribe. Subscribe. Yes. Subscribe, guys. Subscribe your channel. And ring the bell. <laughs> ring the bell as well. Ah. <laughs> and now we're going back home. Bye. So we're going to eat food now. I showered. Food. <laughs> <laughs> Lollipop, lollipop. <laughs> While we were eating, I learned something shocking that Medi was involved in the mafia in Italy. You, mafia? No, I fight. No, I am not mafia. You are fighting mafia in Italy? They punch you? Yes. Why? You should ask from them. <laughs> <laughs> now, you still or now finish with mafia? Still While uh, mafia, there is nothing finished. You yeah. fight with mafia and give you, uh, I give you 1,000 euro. He show you tomorrow, you take your telecamera and talk with them. With mafia? Yes. Why okay. they kill people? Nobody touch you, I say to you. Okay. I just agreed to the most dangerous job of my life. If this goes wrong, I will not only fail the challenge, but also die. Mwah. Mwah. Cheers to traveling. Peace and love. Good night, Giovanni. You are the best. See you tomorrow. We just woke up and look at the view, guys, here. Now we're going back to the factory and they gave me clothes to wear, guys. Look at this. And I'm ready to meet the mafia. Let's go work. Attention! <laughs> Attention! <laughs> now I smell good as well. Probably the last day of my trip. Or the last day of my life. Okay, he's calling the mafia now. Pronto. Oh, Giulio! He arranged for them to come to the factory. My only task was to put a microphone in his pocket and record his conversation with the mafia. Then just give him the sound and the video later. So behind me there. They're fighting. And after 20 minutes, they left. He was extremely happy that he recorded the conversation and he paid me $400. It was a pleasure doing business with you. Bye, my love. Bye, bye. <laughs> He's going to take me now to the airport. This is our last meal. Thank you. Thank you. I love you. <laughs> bye, Italy. Bye. <laughs> My brother, where are you? <laughs> Time to say goodbye. Oh, goodbye, stay with me. Another gift <laughs> for your travel. <laughs> Lollipop. Ciao, bello. Buon viaggio. I love you. I'm not. This is the last country, baby. Hello. Hi. Enjoy your flight. Thank you. Thank you so much. I'm so happy, guys. This is the happiest day of my life. Yeah? Yes. Perfect. <laughs> my seat is there. Everyone got food because they paid, but I got the cheapest flight, so I didn't get food. Is it okay if I eat some of the leftovers? <laughs> yes. Somebody ate it and eat it. Okay. It's okay. Thank Just you. for the Now I can eat as well. <laughs> Los Angeles. Welcome to the United States. Good to be back. The sun is going down. This is the last day of the challenge. Day 17. It's been a crazy journey, guys. I'm not gonna lie. You can't imagine how happy I am. I travel around the planet with no money. Oh. Were people kind to you? Yes. Good. All the people that were kind to me, I got their addresses and oh. I'm going to send them a present. Can you start spending money now or do you have no money? No, I have to go to my house to start spending money. Okay. Time to steal the metro. This is the metro. You know how it goes. <laughs> this is the last time I would need to steal a train. I'm here in the Hollywood street and I'm walking back home. Oh my god. This trip was an emotional roller coaster for sure. I'm back! You can't imagine how much I want to go and jump in my bed. Oh my god! This was the craziest experience ever. 
Oh my god! Home sweet home. Finally, guys. Ah. Uh. And now it's time for the quote. The stories we tell ourselves shape who we are. If we believe people are selfish, we will create a selfish society.